You are watching the longest running weekly episodic television show in history. This is Monday Night Raw, and these two men are two of the reasons why. John Cena versus Triple H in what could be John Cena's final appearance on Monday Night Raw. And this is how Triple H gained control. Wait a minute, cover, put the leg on Cena, who kicks out? Whoa. What a battle this has been. During the commercial break, watch this, the game blasting John Cena right into... Ryan and Michael Cole's laps over here almost. And remember, King, John Cena reached that agreement with Randy Orton that if Cena lost to Orton Sunday at bragging rights, that he would leave Monday Night Raw forever. Hence the reason this could be Cena's final match. Our guest host tonight, Snoop Dogg, still to come. SmackDown's team captain for bragging rights, Chris Jericho, against Raw's team captain, Shawn Michaels, one-on-one. -on -one. And this is a grueling match with Triple H and John Cena are locked up in right now, but nothing. Well, I say nothing compared, but I mean, as I said, this is grueling, but an Iron Man match is one hour. One hour of just beating, beating each other like this. Now, Triple H, I mentioned before, has been in two. He was telling me earlier how grueling and brutal that one hour time limit is. Ooh, and look at Cena go. Get back in it. Here comes Cena. Miss Wildly. And oh. that's Vincent Cena. Here he goes again. Oh, no. And Triple H, though. The polished and canny game had Cena scouted perfectly. But look at, look at the condition the Triple H is in right now. And, and imagine Randy Orton's got to be thinking, John Cena just pounds on me for one solid hour this Sunday. Whoa! Oh, look at it. Oh, just the time. Oh. And right to the back of the leg goes Triple H. The chop block brings Cena down. Yes, anything goes Sunday. No rules. Uh oh, went for it again. John Cena steps out of the way. Goes for the STF. Can he lock it in? This is a submission maneuver. Can't get him. Can't get him. Cena actually suckered Triple H in. Got one up on the cerebral assassin. But Triple H, knowing where he is at all times in the ring, got to the bottom rope to force the break. Oh, and Triple H. Almost like he was playing possum there, just like Cena did earlier. Cena was going to go for a good clothesline there, but he caught a boot instead. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh, Cena. Oh. Fisherman suplex. Cena, Cena with a ton of momentum going right here. Yeah, trying to get on some sort of run. No. Again, thwarted as he went for the bulldog. Both of these superstars so evenly matched. 19 world champions between the two. Boy, I'm going to tell you something. These two superstars, Triple H and Cena, are unloading on each other. Going for the pedigree. Oh, look at Cena. It. He's got it. STF. STF. It's locked in. Will the game tempo? Will the game it. tempo? Triple H is in trouble. Cena. Can Cena do it? Watch the game left hand. Watch, watch his right hand. Here he goes. How much does Triple H have left? Needs to throw to the bottom rope. Can he haul Cena's body there? Look at him trying to scratch and claw his way to that, that rope. Fingertips away. Oh. Cena reverses. Back to the center of the ring. Now look at the game fight to keep. And they should go. Is he just lost a golden opportunity there. What a goose bump filled moment. Hey, 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 pedigree coming. Pedigree connecting. Get him. The pedigree. Triple H closing in on a win over John Cena. It's over. Pumps the leg. Woo! Cena gets this foot on the bottom rope. And we continue. Triple H and Cena in the midst of a classic. What a battle. We'll be back on Raw.